Hi, sweetians! Welcome back to Sweetieville. If you're new to my channel, welcome to Sweetieville. I am Sweetie Pie, and today we are back with a how to update your day. <laughs> day. Yeah, how to update your game for the new expansion, Discover University. So, um, like I've said before in past videos, we will be doing this together as I need to do this for my game. So, I have a few things up on the screen. As you see, one of the first things I always update is my MC Command Center for The Sims 4. Um, I'm not affiliated with them at all, but however, I'm going to plug them. If you have Discord, I would highly recommend you get on with them through Discord because everything I will be doing, I have gotten my information from them through Discord on what I need to fix, and it's just so much easier. They are so nice, so helpful, and going through them just makes all my stresses disappear for this because sometimes when you play with mods, it can be an absolute nightmare every time the game wants to update. You're so happy to have something new, but you're so sad because you got to spend how long before you can play the new stuff updating everything. So, the first thing we're going to do is update our MC Command Center to do the 6.6.2. And then, of course, I have the woohoo, so 6.6.2. And all you got to do for that is to click on it. It's going to pop up down here, save as and make sure it's going into your right file and click save, which you can already see I already have for both of these before I hit the start button, because yeah, I like messed up. So I'm not gonna do that this time, but yeah, that's how you do that. And then same for this one. So that is the MCC Center. And if you see me looking down, it's because I have um, Discord on my phone for them. And I am literally going through and they're telling me what's knew what's not and like it just blanked and now I gotta scroll again because yeah I like let my phone time that that's great so now that I thought I was set up I am not because I'm doing this all right so we got MC command center which is fixed if you have um screw boom booms <laughs> like I can pronounce that tuning error um you'll need to re-download that one um Nelly Sims um, so has to remove his mods until he can get a chance to update them. Um, the Spellbook Injector by R3M. Um, they're working on the vampire things from Earthly the Vampire King. So, stay tight there. There's a new UI cheat. So, we're going to go there next and grab that. So... Normally I have these already, but not today. I just wanted to jump in and play. So we'll go here. There's, you know, I like mod the Sims. And then pretty sure he has his Patreon on here as well. I swear. Okay, I'll have to do it the other way. UI cheat. Sims for Patreon. And it should come right up with him. Da, da, da. There he is. This is not Patreon again. Why did you give me this? That is not Patreon. Let's see. He just wants to make my life weird. Da, da, da.
is not it. So usually it comes right up. Here we go. Man, that was hard. All right, the more cast columns has been updated now to go along with everything. So you want to um, make sure that you get that again. Version 1. 1.16.0. One point five eight. Oh, I didn't want the picture. I wanted to actually go to your UI cheats. Thank you. And now. Well, it's hard to get on here. It's supposed to be 1.58.63. We're just going to download it and we'll see. Because some of the times ugh, they keep it on their thing. And then save as, it'll come up. And there it is under the right folder. So we are good. And I will link you those as well. And then, um, of course, he has the cast columns as well. So we are going to grab that really quick while I am here. Because those are updated as well. And I'm only going to go to the three, I believe. I don't have as much as I used to. I cleaned it out, so... We're just going to go three. All right, we're good there. And then if you have um, mods by zero, you need to get on his Patreon. He has some updates as well. Um, any CC tubs or showers are likely to be broken, so make sure to just take them out so that you don't have any problems. The simulation lag fix has been updated, so you need to get that. Um, Little Miss Sam has updated her mods, so let's go there next. Little. Where is Sam? Mods. Sims 4. Do, do, do. And straight to it we can go. Here we are. So, if you have the healthy drinks, then um, you'll need that one. Choose who you can call to mill. More viable venues. Some small random mods um, have been done. She has um, added more things to universities. So you can, if you have the quick shower and quick bath, you need to update. Send Sims to bed, need to update. Um, buy comfortable cushions, buy better mattress, live in services, roommates, or foster family. And they're all up here. And then all of these are the ones that needed an update. So if you have any of these and they are not on her list up above, 
then you'll need to take them out. So I have a lot, so let's just pull this bad boy up. So you're gonna pull up your documents, electronic arts, Sims 4, mods, and I have them in here by creator's name. And then I just go to Little Miss Sam, where is she? Oh, I left her over here, didn't I? Yep. I forgot to move her over. That is why you taste the little bit. Sam's right underneath. Oh my goodness. All right. So let's see here. I like to set them side by side so I can see. All right. So quick shower and quick bath. Let's see if we got that one. No. Send Sims to bed. I don't think I have that one either. Mm. No. I know I don't have the buy mattress or the cushions. I think I have the live-in services. Yep, live-in services. So let's grab that. I like to hit the send file share there because it'll take you straight to it. Then download, save as, and we're gonna go right here. All right. Do, do, do. The roommates mod, I don't think I have that one from her. I focus more on family stuff um the foster family i was going to get that one but i don't think i did yet do, 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 do. yeah i don't have that yet so and then she has some random small mods that has been updated i don't think i have that one i want to let her make sure it's like i said i have a lot of her stuff Okay, so I only have one because I know I don't have those. So if you have these, you need to. If you have anything on this list, you will need to take it out um, because she has to update them all and she has not got there yet. So she will put up an update. So make sure to follow her on her Patreon as soon as she does. You'll see a little tab thing like this that says she has it up. So pretty much I got to take out all of her stuff. So then there is doo, doo, doo. Scarlet Sims, um, Sim City's loans and social anxiety trait are broken and still require an update. So let's go check out Scarlet's mods because I know we have a few of those. Sims for mods, Scarlet. There we go. There we are. She makes wonderful mods. So let's see what she has. Please remove old versions and re-download those that have been updated. Please let me know if you have any issues. Bug fixes, no cold clothing inside fixed, a rare bug. Oh, I think I have that one. All right, so once again, let's pull this up. And Scarlet Mods here. All I have is the no clothing inside and the homework mod from her. So I need to go here. No cold clothing inside. We need to re-download this bad boy. We'll scroll down to the download button. Save as. There it is. We are good. And then, do, do, do. I don't have the socially anxious trait or the swim Sim City loans. Or did I get Sim City loans? 
Yep, I did try the Sun City ones, so I need to get that again. So you click here, Sun City ones is up. I have not had a chance to put this feature up on my channel yet, but I did just get it. And then you scroll down to this beautiful download thing she has, and save as, and there we go. So that is all I have from her. And social interests. Ooh, she's got plain tea up. Okay. Buy magic items from computer. Ooh, I didn't know she did that. All your plants. Ooh. Okay. I need to stop. That was October. November. Doo -doo -doo -doo. All right, there. So this one. Need to read more on this one. Um, so if you have the aging fix, all your plants ask to move in, bad grades, children, toddlers can die, faster brewing, faster retail, free hire, island event location, kiss neck, no all required, no outfits required, plain tea, rubbish, blocked, Sin City loan social. Okay, so the homework mod seems to be fine and was not affected, so we're not going to worry about it. Um, base mental drugs, if you have that, has an update, so you need to go re-download that. Um, there is the clean UI from Posted Mexi. So, we need to go get that. can type would be a lot easier and I think it's this one I don't remember we'll find out as soon as I get there um no 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 oh clean UI Did we have an update on another one, I think? No. Okay. So, the clean UI, if you want that, will need to be done. Um, if you have the influence emotion fix for vampires, that's updated. Um, let's see. Do, do, do. Wicked Whims has an update, so you need to go there. The more cast columns, which I already told you about, so I put twice. Um, Kawaii Stacy has a few updates, so let's go check out her. Till I go there often. Okay, right up in my thing. Um, doo -doo -doo. Go to her fun page because this is not it. Well, I guess it is. And there's that. I don't think it is. Yep, I understand. I'm on my own. I get it. 
why I'm doing this. <laughs> Let's see. Come on. Just click that off, and then she comes up here. Um, I went to the wrong place. I don't need her downloads, I need her form. And updates. Click the red one. All right. You still got more of that. You got. You got. All right. So November patch. She has all of her mods updated, and I'm like stuck. Sorry. Oh. Yes. Shut up. They're being fed. Um. So, it broke some of her mods. So, Slice of Life, she's got an update. Explorer mod has an update. Life Decider has an update. Um, better Schools, Visit Hospital, The Traits Bundle. Um, now she has a whole list here. I'm not going to read it to you, but some of them are saved. Some of them are updated. Some of them she was working on, but she has them all done now. So we're going to go down here. Excuse me. My nose is itching. And I know I have her Explorer mod. Come on. Load up for me. There we go. Explore mod. Hey. Darn ad. Got him away. Dun 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 dun. And download some file share. Click. And always hit the heart so I know I got it. And save as, of course. I love how she put the date in there. That was really helpful. Um, let's see what other mods of hers do I have. You already done your job. Okay, I have her and the other one. I need to move them over. I just forgot. No, I did have us. That's right. Yeah. So the traits bundle I'll need. Life to say da 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 traits bundle. Oh, she doesn't have it listed here. Oh, there it is. Traits bundle I will need. And the graveyard mod, did that need anything? The graveyard mod was fine. Great. One less thing to worry about. And the pool party event was probably fine, but I'll look. Pool party event. Yep, was totally fine. Okay. And that's all. Oh. I have for her at this point were those four. Come on, give me my abs so I can get it off. Thank you. Go down, do do do. Send file share. Do 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 do. Da da da. Download. Safe as. And save. Okay. So we got hers. Keep tablets and inventory mod. You need to go re-download. Um, Sacrificial has some mods. So if you have any of their mods, you need to go re-download. 
Um, we did the Little Miss Sam already. Do, do, do. Wicked Whims, go re-download. If you have the CC Wrench and Icon Override, it has got stuff, so you need to go re-download it. Turbo Careers, you need to go redo it. Um, I know I'm gonna like hack this, but Beach and updates B I E N C H E N gonna go re download. Um, the NSB bank had an update, no party. Um, toddler swearing had an update. Um, let's see here. No less city living island living non playable character names had an update. Wicked whims, even though the update is still having some crashing issues, so be aware if you are still having issues after the update, you might just have to go take them out. Um, Basement old gangs public had an update. all right so i think we are through them all that we have currently have and those are all the ones that i know of um and i'm just clicking away here before i give you links so i need to stop i need to stop stop me okay so we have all of those i'm just gonna tab everything down so i can start over so then i'm gonna bring it up i'm gonna bring up downloads these are all my downloads then bring up my documents folders, electronic arts, The Sims 4, mods. Make sure you have your two folders, you know which ones are which and what you are doing. So, Little Miss Sam. I need to take out all of her mods. Oh gosh, this is gonna be so sad. Okay, Little Miss Sam. I'm just gonna pull you out while you are playing update and I'm gonna create a new folder little miss Sam Mars. Okay, so it'll say it's updated for November. So that one is Little Miss Sam. Those are Quiet Stacy. And that all is there. All right. So, poor little girl. Oh. Then, new folder. You're going to rename this one Control C. Click here. Rename. Control V. Put this one up in it, then go in, and then you're going to right click on it, extract all here, extract, ta-da, we got it. All right, so that is updated, then we're going to have to go to a Kawaii Stacy. so the traits bundle, I need to just delete. No need to save you because I already got you. So we need to move the traits bundle and the explore mod because you know I already had issues with the explore mod, so I took it out already. So then we're going to rename control C, click a folder, rename, control V, put it up in there, click to rename, control C, click to rename. Control V and where'd it go? Explore them all. All right, double click here, right click, extract, and go. Um, 
Bubblegum blue clay. Okay, so we're having an issue. The bubblegum clays are not wanting to work. Right. So all the clays I'm skipping because I'm seeing to have an issue having the clays open. All right, so that might give us an issue. Then the bundle pack, we're gonna right click, extract all and go. Yep, we're good there. So Kawaii Stacy is done. So then we have Scarlet Mods. And we have the clothes, the clothing thing. Yeah, I'm not even saying it, never mind. In you go. And then her Sim City loans. And rename, control C, new folder, control V. There you go, put it up in there. Then right click here, rename, control C, new folder, control V, da da da. Put it up in there. Then, oh, put them in the same one. Um, okay. SimCity loans in the SimCity loans. There we go. All right, then extract all. That's when you get a little too fast and you screw yourself up. Extract all. All right, we should be good there. Scarlet Mods all done. Need to go back here because do, 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 do. the MC need to delete and the script need to delete. The more cast need to delete. More cast can come in now. Says you are updated and then UI. Delete, delete. UI needs to go over, extract all, delete. Just get, go away a minute. So we're gonna take this, Need easier to go here, hit your documents folder again, not downloads folder, ah, <laughs> documents folder, electronic arts, Sims 4, mods, then we're going to scroll down to our UI. They need to be one folder deep, so you need to move it into here Click that off, then you're good. And then you can delete this one and delete that one. And you're one folder deep. If that's too complicated, just move them to your desktop, delete them, and then move them back in and you got it, it's the same thing. Um, I just did it the harder way, I guess. Back over here, we're going to rename, control C, New folder, control V. And then we're gonna put this one in that one. Then we're gonna rename this one, control C. New folder, control V. And then we are going to put this one in that one. Then we're gonna go in and extract. And go in and extract. Then you can delete it. I don't know why I didn't when I was in here, but you know, I didn't. And then, and if you hold down your shift, you can click both of them and then move them both over. And they'll fly down here. There they are. So, voila. We are updated, so the only other thing we need to do is check for any beds or um, shower override. 
not bad. Um, shower or tub? I don't think I have any. So no showers came up. Because I usually don't do CC. That is those, so I don't have any of those, so we shouldn't. The only other thing they said is causing some issues is items if you've downloaded custom items that have like a lot of slots on them. So say um, the um, oh, not that one. Where is my stuff? Oh, little Miss Sam's ultrasound. You gotta come out. Got that, got that, got that, got that. Um, the, yeah, OMSP shelf. That's causing some issues. I'm going to run mine with it in to see. Um, but if you've downloaded, like, any, like, TV stands or extra, like, in table things where they've updated and added slots to them where you can have slots everywhere, those are probably going to crash your game. Um, the next thing I do after I do all of this is we're going to come over here. This is the one I'm on. Yeah, I have so much going on my computer, sorry. And then it is called a what? Yep. Sims 4 Studio. We are going to go here. All right, I believe it is this one here. Yep, okay. So, they have not updated since May. So, this will probably have an update here soon. I'm surprised it doesn't already. Let me go to their forum. Um, let's see here. That's not going to give me what I want. This is the most one that's been updated. And then I go all the way down to the last page. All right. Um, da -da 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 -da. Trying to see if it's been updated. Whoops, I didn't think so. Which is quite weird for them.
I don't think so, so I want to launch it and find out. So, there's this thing I have. It's called a Sims 4 Studio. Let's launch this bad boy. And it will look at all your mods in your game. And since this, you know, added things like Shower Woohoo and stuff, I figured that they'd have to come up with a new update. They just might not have got there yet. Considering how many it just came out. Do, 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 do. It's loading in all my crap and I got it all, so give me a second. It will take a moment. Plus, my computer's just a little slower because, oh, uh, yeah, I have everything running for y'all, so it takes a little longer. Do, do, do. Um, the only other thing you did miss is, you know, I put my password in in Origin. As you can see, I'm already logged in. And it already updated. And no, I did not go in and take my mods out. As you've seen, they are still in there. I told you guys I do this all the time. And that's what I do. So I go up to content, batch fixes, objects. Yeah, the last they have in here is for the Island Adventures. Um, but this is where you can update all your stuff that they have. So there'll be one coming out for this one, I guarantee. Um, but it's not going to do anything. But you would just go into content here, batch fixes. And then scroll down and it'll say have a fix for cc showers and does stuff like that once you do and run it it'll save it and then you can do like shower woohoo in it and stuff and it will update it so it won't crash your game it's pretty much what it does so now we are good i'm going to go to my game library as you can see it downloaded university for me it says i have new content installed i have not launched since then i put in all the new stuff took out all the old and i'm hitting play for the first time so let's see are we gonna crash are we gonna have to do some more or are we all good so you guys see my uploads and i have a lot of reshades so yeah that's a hot minute too sorry so we'll just give it a moment as it loads in all 70 different shades effects Oh, it looks like we're doing good so far. I'm not crashing. Everything's going good so far. Usually if you can get this and get to the main menu, you're good to go. You are golden. But the first round shot is usually the hardest. So we'll see what it's doing. then we're gonna have to play some university are you guys excited i am and i'm not i mean i've never went to college in my life besides my work college classes if you want to call them college because you know really it was doing it pretty much online around work so it really wasn't college um so yeah i think it's gonna be totally awesome to see it but i'm not like overly excited it's not like something i went through in my life so i'm ready to replay it you know it's not that great yep then you have your things that says your game has been updated and mods have been disabled so everything is in i got my discover university do this really quick why I got you here sorry but yeah it's happening okay now that I have that so then once you're here you, you need to go through these there's lots of updates on here for y'all 
then you're going to hit your game options they have an accessibility tab so you can change your stuff which is kind of cool then you're going to go to others and now custom blah 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 i can click view if i want um i have the in-game surveys turned on so they may do that oh it logged me out so i'll have to fix that i'll do that later and then you're going to click apply and you can go out so here's your real tough so you gotta exit your game bye bye i'll come back soon wait patiently for me all right and now here's your real test so you got your first launch in so now you're launching your first time with your mods so you know you're making sure everything is good and then once again it's just the sit and wait game after you hit the button to let it read everything or see if it crashes so Am I going to be a lucky person with all that OMSP stuff in there and stuff? Or am I going to have to play the 50-50 game? Man. Taking it a minute. I'm quite impatient. Come on. Come on, come on. <gasps> there it goes. Gets about in a minute. It's taking it quite a minute, but it's rolling it now. There we go. So since I got this, we should be good to roll and play, but there's one more step I always do. Come on. Get there. And it's a thinking, it's a thinking, it's a thinking, a thinking really, really slow. Oh, thinking way too slow for me. So, <laughs> are you gonna go? Are you gonna crash? 50-50, hmm. who knows? It's hard telling. Because usually once you get it to roll, if you get that far, you're usually pretty good. But every now and then I'll get it to crash before then. <laughs> Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> there we go, it's moving now. Maybe. Maybe not. So letting you guys sit through my whole pain of life with me. So are you guys enjoying when I do these? Or would you like me to cut this part out and just tell you it took a minute? Or just let you see? Because, you know, I do have all these um screen things. As you can see, that plumb ball was spinning really fast to catch up with everything that it stalled through. And I have a lot of uh, CC, the opening menus and stuff, because of my recent problems. The darker colors are really helping 
um, my head and being able to play a little longer and enjoy it. So you'll see my screen brightness went down all of that when it launches. So it's part of it. And it's still a thinking. It's not quite too sure. It wants to do it. Or maybe it thinks it did and that UI is bad. Because it's not saying it didn't. Hmm. Well, give it a minute or two more. Sometimes you just gotta be patient with the first load, which is the hardest part for most people. Especially me. Yeah, I can't see my stuff. I think I've crashed. Kinda, kinda not. I think I just need to take out my uh, Team Moon shaders and have to wait for them. Yeah, I'm gonna try without it. So, if this happens, because you know, I can't click my game out normally, and you know, you click this, or you can't see anything to go out, so you're gonna hit Control, Alt, and Delete at the same time on your keyboard. You'll get a task manager. Oh, there's my game coming. Maybe. No, it's not. So then you're going to click on this to highlight it, tell it to end it, and it will safely shut it down in this process. So I'm going to need to go to my documents folders, electronic arts, Sims 4, mods, and... Purple came up. The launcher didn't. So let me just take out the launcher and see if the world screen works in the purple. And then the king, I just have the icons, yeah. And those were fine. Oh, I forgot to do one other thing. So once you do that, and you're in your mods, back up to your Sims 4, one folder, go down here, yep, I got a last exception. It messed up. So, I'll delete that. You're gonna delete your local thumbnail. Get on it and delete it. And it will tell the game to reconfigure itself when it opens. If you have anything in this folder here, it is safe to delete, or this one here, it is safe to delete, but I keep this one in it and it's fine. So now I got that out. Let's try again. Launch. Let's see if it was just that one that I'll need to redo. I didn't see anyone saying that those were conflicting their games, but that doesn't mean anything. And let's give it a moment to read everything again. It's moving a little faster this time on it. Maybe that was the only one screwing up, I don't know. We'll get in and find out. Do, do, do. 
So you guys are seeing a little bit more of my uh, living room wall behind me. My, my kink living room wall. Yeah, because I'm sitting in a different chair. I'm actually sitting a little lower. So I had to move my camera so you don't see more of my white wall. You see more of the pink on the bottom with my border. Alright, are we going to make it this time? Maybe let's say I'm not responding again. <laughs> Hello, come on, come on. Let me in. I pray to the Sims God. And this is where everybody with mods gets very impatient. And the best thing you can do for your game is to just be patient. It needs to read everything. Yeah. Not what I thought of. Okay. So how's everybody doing on this wonderful Friday? Great, I hope. Don't know what I'll talk about while I'm sitting at a white screen waiting impatiently because I'm tapping my foot. You guys can't see it. <laughs> As my dog stares at me from across the room, she's just like, what are you doing, mother? I know. I see you. I see you, baby. She's just looking at me like, what? <laughs> oh. Mm -hmm -hmm. Okay. Now let me double check. <laughs> no, I hit that button, didn't I? Okay. K I X G. Oh, okay. There we are. Yep. I have to redo the classic icons. It is him that is messing it up. Because it just came in today earlier. So, my bad. Open in a new tab. Oof. 
but it's, it's trying. I don't remember where I'm at. I'm over here. <laughs> I'm like, uh, you know what? Okay, there we are. I want the STEM file share, please. Download. Save as. And there we go. All right. Oh my gosh, it came up with it. Okay. I'm going to leave it, but so far, so good. So we have all that. Um, check the patch is out. Free, new, Max is curated. Check it out. That's so cute looking. Okay. So we're going to click my load game. And I have a tester family right here that I play with just new games. So all my new games, pack reviews, all of them are done through these guys. And this is the reason so I can try things out. <laughs> oh, say it's spring. Thought I've smacked that once since I've been here, but okay. Go here to their little house that I've built on 50 million times for different packs. Surprise, it looks as decent as it does. It's just like a pack house. It just changes constantly. So, the loading screens are having a little bit of issues because I have those mods in. So if I didn't have them, it'd probably be better. But, I like the darker screens. Yeah, I know. I, I took out a lot of custom builds. I get it. Alright, so here's my play pack house. You will see that. Whoa. Boy. My mouse is finicky. Whew. It uh, messed with some settings I'll have to go fix. It's like, it's going crazy. Crazy, baby. Little mouse moves. Whoa, little mouse moves. Little moves. I'm gonna make everybody sick. Can you tell the last pack review I did with this house was laundry day? Oh, good, great. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> okay, so we're in. Everything seems to be just fine. So I will test them out more further with the pack review. So that is how I install a new game. I check all my mods and get up and running and I didn't cut anything out so you can see me from start to finish on what I did with my game except for just loading the pack in which you know who wants to sit through a download button so I only saved you that and I did not take my mods folder out when I did it and you've seen that so I just put in my password let it go and it works fine every time for me. This is how I do it. So if you have any questions, leave them down below. If I know the answers, I will happily help you all out. And until next time, all my Zoonians out there, have a Zoonylicious day. Bye, guys.